What's going on guys? Not sure if I want to classify this as a shop tip video or maybe as a tool review, perhaps a little bit of both. But uh, I wanted to show you guys a tool that many of you may not even be aware of uh, unless you work in the industry or uh, you know maybe know somebody who does. But uh, this is a tool that I found quite useful uh, just in general use around my shop, uh, especially for knife making. And uh, what these are, these are called Cleco clamps, K-L-E-C-O if I recall correctly. And uh, these were originally intended for sheet metal work, uh, for holding two pieces of sheet stock together. And uh, I'm sure I got a couple flat pieces of something here just to give an example. You, know, you clamp them together like that, do your drilling, uh, riveting, tack welding, what have you, and uh, then remove them when you're done. Uh, but I've, I've actually found them uh, just as useful uh, for my purposes in knife making uh, in several different applications. Uh, one, for instance, being marking patterns onto my flat stock for scribing. Just a quick example here. You could put a couple of them in place, start scribing your pattern. And uh, then if you need to move them or reposition them at all, it's just this fast and easy. Really don't even need more than two of them. Uh, you can kind of get back in the empty spots. Uh, they're very low profile, don't really take up a whole lot of room, so you're not missing a whole lot having them in your way as much as say a larger clamp would be and uh, they're extremely secure and reliable and uh, much more efficient I think than uh, these little C clamps for instance uh, much more low lower profile even than a squeeze clamp you know these kind of a two-handed operation uh, in many cases you know you kinda gotta get that perfect distance and then uh, sometimes you'll kinda mar your work up even with these uh, sharper ends there Yeah, I see a lot of guys using these. Uh, you can see how much bigger they are. And kind of in the way of everything. And uh, really, they don't clamp anywhere nearly uh, as effectively, in my opinion. So what's nice about these, they're lower profile. You know, they don't really get in the way when you're drilling with them in place. And uh, if they do happen to be somewhat in the way, again, you can... Kind of move them around as needed uh, quite easily and efficiently just however they might fit and uh, you're good to go now due to their lower profile smaller size they are uh, a little bit more limited on clamping capacity uh, these are about an inch deep you get maybe about half an inch uh, Possibly 9 sixteenths if you really squeeze on them. But uh, for knife making, especially slip joint making, uh, that's usually more than enough. You know, here's a back spring, two scales. Uh, I can even fit, you know, probably a couple of liners in here if I needed. So, yeah, I've got plenty more room there uh, for another liner. And I can kind of hold all that together, uh, drill it if I need to. And then when I'm done, it just comes right off. Uh, doesn't leave any evidence of having been there, uh, being that the jaws are soft. Uh, these are made out of aluminum. And, uh, you know, they stay nice and parallel, give even clamping pressure. And uh, just a really neat little tool uh, that I think a lot of you guys uh, should find useful. So uh, that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, call it a shop tip or a tool review. But, uh, you know, these are really handy to have. I'm sure you'll find all kind of uses for them. 
And uh, what's nice is they're really not that expensive. Uh, I've seen these uh, sold on their own, you know, 25, 50 of them you can get for less than a buck a piece. Uh, these range probably about $12, $15 uh, for a pair of these. Sometimes you can find them together in a set. Uh, you know, get 12 or 20 of them with the handle for, you know, 25, 30 bucks. Uh, it's a pretty good deal. So check it out, uh, eBay, Amazon, uh, Metalworking Supplies. Uh, I'm sure you'll find them in a number of places. But uh, I found them to be quite useful, and I think you will too. So thanks for watching, guys.